This is the scene of the vibrant Mercado da Rivera here in Lisbon, Portugal. Uh, this is what Portugal is all about, folks. The food. As you can see, this market is beyond its capacity right now. And this is a Tuesday afternoon. There are stalls of all from all sorts. All sorts of people come here, especially to sample the cuisine of Lisbon. Now I can see why it is so such a want to see something you know something that people would want to come and uh, see and uh, be a part of if it's just for a day once you're here in Lisbon because it is indeed a very organized looking market, food market. Uh, and as you can see, any time of the day, this would be like this because it has its reputation. It is known especially the famous uh, pastéis de nata, artesanias, homemade Portuguese custard tart. That's what it is. Pastéis de nata, artesanias. This is what it looks like. This I'm happy to, to have able to show on you this wonderful place here in Lisbon. Also has flowers. If you want to give your loved one a flower, little flower shops here as well. Beautiful place. But that's the main area there where the market is, where they, you can sit and have lunch. 
until late in the afternoon, I assume. Very, very interesting place. So is it? This is the outside of it. Mercado de Rivera. Right there, that's it, right there. It's a big clock there. And that's... Okay. Well, they call it the timeout market, so. And the Riviera, Mercado da Riviera, so. Timeout market, Lisboa, Mercado da Riviera. That's what they call it. It's being called back. So if you're ever here in Lisbon, take the opportunity to take a stroll down to the riverfront. And right in front of the train station, right there, you'll find this wonderful place. Where you can go inside and taste the cuisine. Of Lisbon. So I'm heading back. On my way back. From the uh, Mercado. I had to make two videos because I ran out, ran out of space in the first one. <laughs> so I end up having to make... There's, a, there's the people here uh, actually coming from the train station. That's the train station there. And this is the people uh, exiting the building. Station there. It's a big station. It has a supermarket inside. Uh, this looks... Something like a museum, I don't know what it is, or a church, could be a church as well. Se todo por amor de David Jorge. Ah, could be a museum of sort. But this is what a waterfront looks like here in uh, Lisbon, folks. I would say 99% of the tourists that visit Lisbon ended up ends up here somehow or the other, you know. They always ends up here because that Mercado, that time out market is something to see, you know. It's I've showed you it you'd wanna taste the food. You wanna have an idea of what it's like what the food tastes like here and what it's like just eating in a market. It's clean. The vibes are good. And uh, it's right in front of the uh, train station. Easy to access. It means easy accessibility. It's great. I want to cross, maybe I should cross and get into the train area over there and show you a little bit of that, uh, of the waterfront, maybe I can do that, I have to wait for the lights, but I'm enjoying this place, this wonderful city. And uh, what I enjoy most about it is that since I've been here, I've been, I've walked. 
So almost all of the uh, sites, the places that we need to see here in Lisbon. So that makes brings my cost of staying here very affordable. And now I'm looking at the other side. From the other side, that's the market over there, and that's the uh, look like a museum. There's a guy here selling some roast nuts. I'm going to enter this building here, which is a train station. And show you, give you an idea what it's about. Yeah, your ticketing there, you can buy your tickets. I'm sure there's tickets booths as well. There's the train station there, as you can see. Trains over there, and uh, there's a supermarket there. Ping Dose, it's a chain of supermarkets here. And uh, you can always also go down. Maybe a down is a metro. I don't know. So there, I know there's a combination of train and metro. So. Maybe to get a metro you have to go down, but this is what it's like here in this one at the waterfront. It's a very organized looking supermarket here where you can go and buy anything. I may return to eat something there. I would have loved to eat in the um, Mercado, but as you can see, the Mercado is filled. <laughs> so much people. Enjoying that atmosphere. Now, this is another part of the train station here that I don't know. It looks like I, I have to get to get beyond this point. I would need a ticket. So, just let's go inside and see what it's all about. Okay. Ah, all right. Also a little pharmacy here. There's people waiting for uh, the uh, oh that's the waterfront. That's the waterfront. Yeah, it's great to tell me <laughs> not there. I can't go any further. So yeah, I had to exit the building. You know, you can only film certain places. You, you you're restricted to film. So I'm going to take a, like a side walk here around the building, so I can show you the waterfront. Give you an idea what the waterfront looks like as the river. You can see there's. Uh, Big river here with uh, ferries and restaurants. Uh, I guess the ferry docks right there. It's a big ship over there, container ship. In the distance. This is what the riverfront look like. Big restaurant here. Yeah. Different restaurants actually. Oh man. This is so lovely, eh? Sit and have lunch and watch the river. The ferry is in the river. Huh? Coming across and going. Abu restaurant.
This is what it's like here in Lisbon. Wonderful city, walkable city, charming city. And, uh, there's a ferry coming in, getting ready to dock. It's so amusing because the, the, the uh, ferry connects you with the uh, train and then the train connects you with the bus. <laughs> Very organized. There's another part, this part of the city I have to go and uh, take a trip one day and go and see what's over there because uh, I can take that ferry there and uh, I can go over there. There's the statue of Christ over there. The statue of Christ, 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 something like that. And there's uh, more about two to three ferries that are maybe more. I would say uh, just in there's one, there's one over there, there's two, and I know there's one over up above there. So there's about three just in this area. Just. To, to be able to cross and get to the other side. So, this is the riverfront. People just sitting around enjoying their uh, day because it's about what time now? It's about 1.30. Wow, I thought it was later. It's people sitting in the sun because it's uh, nice, cool, it's not hot. And they're just enjoying their day here, you know. Uh, wow, this is something, isn't it? Well, I'm here and I'm enjoying it, so, folks, walking on the riverfront, like so many other people, locals and tourists alike, enjoying the wonderful paradise here, this planet. We gotta do this, we gotta do it now. Yeah. Let me show you a little boat there. It looks like a, you can sightseeing. It's a sightseeing boat you can also make a do a tour on one of those uh, boats you know tour of the river but there's many there's many things to do here in Lisbon so much you can do you can there's there's a there's a, a, a bus that goes directly in the sea and will take you to the other side as well you know we call it like a, a, a sea boat uh, uh, I'm gonna see a sea boat, I mean a bus boat that would go from land to to the river and it will take you across. It's designed for that purpose. And uh, really interesting. <laughs> Very interesting.
Very nice, very nice. Oh man. Said thank you. Oh, such a lovely place. The next thing I want to see is the water aquarium. They has a, a big sea aquarium, you know, uh, here in this one as well. Uh, I have to go and see that. It has mammals from all sorts of mammals, and they say it's one of the best in the world, so. I have to make uh, sure I take the opportunity to go and visit that as well. I don't know if I'll be able to take any videos, but if they let me, I will. I will show you Sea Aquarium. That should be really interesting as well. It's a nice uh, little area here. You can sit, and have lunch. I mean, look at that lunch! Look at that! Wow, folks! I mean, you can get anything here you want. Any type of food. If you're into vegetarian stuff, if you're into meat, if you're into sardines and bacalao, <laughs> salt fish here.